Hi and welcome to the Home Engineers channel. Today what I'm going to show you is how I set up a V-block in a vise and get it all lined up nice and central. First of all what I'm going to do is I've got these collars here that just need an M6 drill and tap to hole through and they're just going to be some locking collars for um, a ring roller that I'm building um, to stop the rollers from moving along the shafts. So I need to place them in the chuck like so and then I want to make sure that each one is on centre so that I can reposition it for, for tapping. So the first thing to do is I need to get the datum correct in this in this plane here which is your Y axis and to do that I'm simply going to use this um, cylindrical wobbler because it is a 10mm diameter and I want it to be 5mm away from the edge this would just be perfect so once it flicks off that will then give me the um, correct position in, in that plane and then I will then show you how I set the other plane up using the stop as well that I've made um, so that each one can go back in the same position each time. Okay, so let me start this up and I'll wobble on. So that's set that plane in the y-axis. And now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use a standard piece of uh, high-speed steel in the chuck. And because the bottom's ground flat, it makes it a lot easier then to, to line up the, the V block. I'll just offset that a little bit more so it's a bit clearer on how it works. So what all I do now is I just bring this down via the quill onto the V block and as you can see that because it's got a flat bottom and has pushed that to the side has to be then central to the spindle. What I then do is I just bring the stock along until it engages lock that off and that is the v-block set in the right position each time so I could then take this out if I need to remove the v-block can put it back in against the stop and each time then that will be over the center line of the tool So just drop the component in, tighten the vise up, and there we go. That now is ready for drilling and tapping, and all four can be quickly put into the vise, into the V-block, knowing that that will be on centre. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and uh, if you have, please subscribe um, to my channel, and thank you again for watching.